What's the latest in terms of business? Uh, not a lot to report further than Saturday. Uh, we have interest in uh, two or three of our players. Uh, we certainly have interest in one or two ourselves bringing in. Depend on Stephen McLaughlin's situation as well. Uh, and we'll just see what happens in the next 36 hours. You mentioned on Saturday after the match that inquiries had been made for John Joe O'Toole and Callan Gordon. At this stage, are they likely to go out? We'll have to wait and see. The uh, deal's got to be right for, for us and the player uh, for it to happen. Uh, so we have had those inquiries. If if the squad's, you know, we've only got 19 games to go. So if the squad is uh, reasonably intact injury-wise, having Riley Harbottle back, you know, George Maris is back from suspension. Um, there's only Anthony Hartigan as a, a long-term absentee. Uh, then it might be that if we can bring one in, we can we can get them out to get to get some football. Don't like players sitting in the stand. You know they were just outside the 18 on Saturday, and I know we've got to just in case we get injuries uh, like we did a couple of weeks ago. We lost five in one game, uh, but with 19 games to go, if the lads are fit and okay, uh, we can take that chance because of the, the strength of the 18, 19 we've got. As we speak here and now, around about 10 past 10 on this Monday morning, how many are you looking at bringing in? Once again, it'll depend on who goes out. Uh, if uh, if Kellen and JJ do go out, what happens with Danny Johnson? What happens with uh, Stephen McLaughlin's injury? Uh, make sure Iran Boatang's OK. Uh, so it'll, it'll depend on those factors. Are you yet talking to players or are you at the stage of inquiries? Uh, well, we can't talk to players until the clubs are <laughs> agree, unless they're free agents. So, uh, sorry, what I meant was it's at that stage where the uh, the bid, if you like, has been accepted. No, uh, no, we're not at that stage. Uh, we have bid for a player uh, in the last couple of weeks that was rejected. Um, we'll see how how if we're going to revisit that and up the bid or not. Uh, and then there's a we've still got loan two loan spaces available as well, uh, which we're keen to use if if necessary. Are you looking now to strengthen in one particular area? No, not yet. No, not really. No, you look at the once again the flexibility of the squad on Saturday. You know, we lost Stephen McLaughlin. Uh, you know, you're playing with wing backs. Kieran Wallace comes on and does an admirable job there. And then, um, you know, you look at Jordan Barry, who was brilliant for the last 10, 15 minutes when he came on. And, and, and uh, ideally, you want somebody, you know, uh, Left-footed like Kieran, uh, he, his position is probably centre midfield. So if we can get somebody to cover Macca, we will do. We'll see. Uh, Danny Johnson was on the bench on Saturday. What's his status at the moment? Just the same as it was before Saturday. Uh, nothing's changed there. Uh, just waiting. It's another one that we're waiting to see what happens in the next 36 hours. The good thing was, you know, it was one of those where you know we, Swanee's come on and got a goal again uh, off the bench, which he's done a lot of times this season, been uh, very productive uh, coming on. Uh, so Danny's just sort of behind him at the moment and uh, we didn't use him so it still leaves it open for any other club as well uh, if it comes to that and you've still got Lewis Page in the building I understand are you looking to sign him? we'll see once we can sign Lewis after the uh, uh, Page after the window so that's not of a great urgency uh, the only thing that concerns us with him uh, he hasn't played for you know he had the game at Notts got injured and so unlucky when he was just looking good uh, so it's how long it will then take to get up to speed with only the 19 games to go Stags are in action tomorrow night at the One Call Stadium again in the not Senior Cup semi-final against Carlton Town. Who's likely to feature? There'll be a few uh, playing. Uh, hopefully first team is mixed in with the academy, which will give them good experience uh, in a men's game and on the, the one course, at the One Call Stadium as well. Uh, so I think Ollie Clark will have a little bit of time. Uh, Riley Harbottle, Jordan Barry, uh, Jimmy Knowles uh, will hopefully start. Uh, we've had a couple of inquiries for him going out on loan. Just unfortunate that uh, Jason Law and James Gale aren't going to be fit for it.